Hey everybody, welcome back to more Banjo Kazooie by the Game Industrials. There it is. There we go. What is that on the right side? Oh, that's oh, a snowman. I think it was. Yes, a snowman. Yeah, I think that's what it's supposed to be. Time out me to bleak off of DKC3 a little bit. Um, yeah, we went ahead and did Clinker's Cavern and did a little more exploring around Rensilda's lair. Also, a for Easy Peak, which we'll cover in the next part. But for now, yeah. let's sign ahead into the swamp. Bubble Loose Swamp, that is. Oh, well, not to say make goop, I meant Bubble Gloop. I was, I've been calling it Bubble Goop Swamp. Whoopsie. I, I used to call it Bubble Lee Gloop Swamp because, yeah, because the E, because that, uh, that one specific E in the name. Oh, gotcha. Yeah, but it's Bubble Gloop Swamp. So, oh, you do the crocodile thing first. Yeah, the crocodile. Yeah, I got cut here, by the way. There you go. Um, yeah, I got feed five crocodiles to get a jiggy. They'll, they'll, they're easy at first, and the ones later on get a little faster. But it's, it's not that hard. Ah, damn it. Ooh. Ouch, ouch. Yeah, I hate when that happens. Oh, there's a mobile token down there. Maybe if you want. Yeah, I'm gonna get it here. I usually, I usually get that when I get the wave booth or wait for the transformation. Fair enough. Oh boy, you gonna do that mission right now? Oh, okay, not now. Uh, I, I think I do it right after. Do this one here first with the big egg. Oh, you think that big mission is hard? Wait till you get to the lair one near Mobile's hut. Mobile's hut. Oh, you're talking about the crocodile? Uh, attack, no, the one before, uh, when you get the mobile with HUT. Oh, 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 I know what you're talking about, yeah. Oh yeah. my god. Yeah, that one's, uh... That, that one, was a fucking troll. It can be a little nerve-wracking, yes. <laughs> Let's get these notes here, and now we got this giant egg. No, there's no, giant, oh. there's no big bird or anything in there, but we're gonna crack it open. Oh, take note of that egg, though. Yeah, we'll be seeing this kind of egg again in, uh... Click cluck wood. Yup. But that's not so much later. Yup. <laughs> I love how you gotta break it multiple times just to get that jiggy. Oh, there was a one up up there. If you wanted to grab it before you start breaking the egg, I didn't. Yeah. Get it. I didn't grab it because I was yeah. wearing this. Yeah, it's fine. Aren't you still at max lives at the moment? Yeah, he yeah. just said that. Yeah, I just didn't bother grabbing it because I was already at max lives anyway, so. No need for it. I, I could I could never understand I could never understand what that token said every time I collected it. <laughs> I always went with that. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so this Shiggy, we're gonna be timed. But this one's easy though, we got 45 seconds. Though if you do fall off, it could cost you. D depending where you fall at that is, so just be a little careful though, that's all I gotta say. Oh yeah, just don't don't stop for anything. No, it's best to just get the uh, jiggy first and then cut the other stuff on the way back. I mean, I've seen someone did it before and it was nerve wracking. Little speed money tactics, sir. Uh huh. <clears throat> now you gotta go back and get the notes. <laughs> yeah, notes, jiggy. And the gingel. And he can bulk them and rock us. Uh, don't. So, yeah, I, I got some stuff to collect real quick. Oh yeah, you, you also want to leave here at the alligator because uh, uh you have that freaking uh that ice block we had to break. That's why. Yes. That's why I broke that before I went into uh <laughs> bubble loose song. If you didn't do that before you went to, if you didn't do that um before then, you would have to yeah. go back out and transform. Oh back my goodness. Zooey, and then, well, you don't have to actually go back in, Bubble, so you just go far enough to, for the match to wear off. Yeah. Then just go back in, transform, or go back out to, um, revert it to Banjo-Zooey. 
Then go back in there to break the ice. Then go with the bubble and swarm and go back. Transfer the crocodile. But shoot, go in and get the sheet then. I know that pain in the ass. That's why you gotta That's why I said, hey, Roz, are we going to break the ice? Break the, break the ice? <laughs> yeah. That's a mouthful too around here. It was. Uh, those and, those, and those rocks are easy, by the way. They, I guess they were kind of considered like a boss in a way because they take two hits. But no. I just go feather them, so it made it a lot easier to kill them faster. Well, the reason why they, they, they're they trying to kill you because they, you were after their jiggy. Of course, he, they will give up. He's after Grunty's uh, jiggy. Protect it at all costs. <laughs> and we're to the switch. Let's see what this does. Here. Ooh, yeah. Go, yeah, go for that first. Oh, yeah, always. Yeah, I almost forgot about that when I went to Momo's Mountain, but. Oh. It's a good thing I uh, missed that moment with Hulkin. Sorry, Rex. Because it might have been. Sorry, not sorry for bringing your hat. Uh, oh, shoot. Remember in, in Ukulele where, uh, when we broke that statue's nose, Capital B bent you out because of it? <laughs> he said, yeah, how he, he's like, how would you like if I break your stuff? You know, shit like that. Try me. That's all I gotta say is try me. That yeah. cartoon sound effect. That's three down, two to go. The heart, oh yeah, they get a little hard because uh, they open their mouth like, like, super quick. Yeah, I mentioned- Just the shoot button. Yeah, I mentioned for like, they'll keep- They'll go oh, faster oh, and faster until we get to the end, then. We'll be all done, then. Oh. Um. Similar to Mumbles Mountains, Jiggy. We had to break all the huts. Yeah, that's four now. So we're about halfway done. Yeah, you might want well to wait till you get to your knife, Jiggy, then go to your transformation. Sure. Yeah. Yeah, it's so yeah, it's best to save Mr. Fowl for last. Oh yeah, who remember him back in the day? I did fall near the end here, but I'll, I'll just say I had a fun time with him. Oh! You saw that freaking criminal of a Donkey Kong? Nah, uh, Donkey Kong Country 2 mainly. Well, I mean, this is the only way to warm his feet up. I brown, pounding, dark, poor foot of the guy. Oh, you can get that ginger right now. Just say the bad tracking. Oh. Yeah, yeah, I did. <laughs> oh! <laughs> He also ate a jiggy. Oh my goodness. Well, he ain't the only one that ate the jiggy. <laughs> so, we got the jiggy. And his mouth is gonna stay open, so we can actually uh, head inside. Yeah, technically, that turtle is actually a place. Yeah. Where there's a music class going on right now. Ollie and yep. in uh, Tink's, Tink Tup's uh, body. Oh, okay, you're better off getting at that honeycomb last, after you get this jiggy. Well, because, you kinda have to. Yeah, cause if you try to get the, uh, the honey piece right now, um, Tint Tump is gonna, he, he's gonna keep on interrupting you. And you gotta watch that stupid cutscene again. Oh yes, this is Tint Tump, by the way. Yeah, from Diddy Kong Racing. Yep. So, when you hear them sing, you need to do, you need to follow the exact pattern. The first two is usually the easiest. The third one may trick you up a little bit. Yeah. So. Oh, and it's fun fact, yes, this game did came out of the day called Racing, by the way. Makes sense. Oh. Yes, the port. We have to bounce pound these poor things. Doesn't bother. And for though. some weird, for some weird ass reason, if you hit the wrong one, you take damage. Yeah. That's freaking stupid. Yeah, you and can die from it, which is also dumb. You can. I hate that so. I hate that so many times back in the day. There's now the third one. phase. Oh my goodness, man. That's why it's gonna get a little tricky because the seven of them are gonna be doing it. Or six, maybe. Never mind. Okay. I had a bit of trouble. This like I kind of forgot through the middle of it with it continue. Oh my goodness. Don't. You better mess up. Yep, see, look what I tell you. Don't. Come on, you hit the wrong top. 
Like, what is fucking hurting you? Oh. What? <laughs> I couldn't remember which one it was I was supposed to hit. There we go. Jimmy Christmas. I mean, I know this one oh. had to get hit at least three times. Oh, shit. Oh, and he got. And the worst part is that you gotta do this shit again. Possibly. Just possibly. Well, I got it now. I finished it, thank goodness. And Garjiki. Oh my god, you got two health left. Oh my god. Well, I have some health left over from killing those uh, yellow frogs, so. Yeah. I can't say those around. Oh, yeah, see, yep, that's why I said that honey come for last. <laughs> well, I know something different you teach is more tip tip up. But uh you yeah. should go you should get prepared for a day called racing. Well he already did. <laughs> well I mean if you were uh if we were back in the late nineteen nineties said yes. Yeah. <laughs> see? Got health here, we're covered. Alright. Yeah, we're good. Oh, and I, well, now we're gonna put a hardest jig in, 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 in the level. What I was talking about, besides the uh, the 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 temp top this shit. Oh, we'll get to that in a minute. I gotta get some notes here first. Yeah. And the ginger. So you really grew up some long legs there when these these wobbly boots. Man, that freaking ginger stuck in the swamp. I wonder why the frying ain't eating his feet off or anything. Here we go. There we go. And hello, buddy. Blue Tanjo. Oh, also, you would probably notice those huts back there. There yeah. were there were some notes and a ginger you could not get. Because oh, yeah, 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 yeah. the space row was too small. You had to have the crocodile transformation to um. Uh, get those remaining notes, Jinjo, even the mumble tokens as well. Yeah, so make sure you get all the notes before you go, before you, uh, transform, before you go on your transformation. Mm -hmm. Yeah, fuck up, man. It's not really worth it, but whatever. <laughs> there we go. And last crook, this is over there. I'm trying to go grab it just a second here. So I'll do it before I go transform. I can't do it, then I have to start that over. Yeah, I remember when I first played Magic with Sue. I, I, knew that, I knew that little notch was a little suspicious. <laughs> yeah, since there's a little hole there you can go in on the side. <laughs> Ow! Damn it. Yeah, I love how uh, the, 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 the piranha is, is biting Kasui's legs and Banjo is screaming. It, it's, it's Banjo's, it's biting. Kasui, it was by Kasui's uh, feet when, he, when she made it in it. Oh, the yeah. still yelled. Should I fuck this shit? <laughs> You're gonna take the hint semi. I mean, yes, I get that they share the same health. <laughs> but it's kinda weird that whatever Kasui's feeling, Banjo fe feels it too. I was gonna say, well, till, um. Uh, Tui. Yeah. When they learn to split, then yeah. That'll be different then. Yup. But you got seven jiggies on you, so. Oh, yeah, the eight jiggy is coming up. Need a little more health, thank you very much. Alright, now it's time to go through a little maze. Oh, you can get, oh, you get, yeah, this jiggy than the last gen, so. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, we got it. Oh, I'm about to reset them. Sounds bad. Yeah, that, that had me plenty of times. You go for that one note, but you, you pass it by a freaking fence. Don't you hate when that happens? Yeah. Well, at least you're not trying to collect a note and jump it down every time you do so. <laughs> Still can't get over that goddamn video. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fucking hell. There we go. He did it, did it again. <laughs> can't help it. <laughs> like I said, they had me play your tops. <laughs> it's these darn wallet boots. 
All right, now for the now for the hardest chicken in, in this world. Yeah, I probably see this for the second hardest. Cause look how many times he going look how many look how many minutes he gonna give you. Ten seconds. Yeah, cause it's like a short path, a short thin path. Oh my god. Okay. Ooh. One second is spare. Yeah, I thought, oh shit, like, I hope that this will work, but they could just... Yeah, if you don't get it, then Runtail's gonna tell you that you were too slow and all that. Have to try again. <laughs> As a cheeky shatters in pieces. Yes. Until you hit the switch again, just reactivates again to show up, but... Yeah, it'll keep happening for ten seconds, so you grab it before time runs out. But sometimes you gotta be a little risky and do a leap of faith and pray you don't fall off. But you have to be extremely careful doing so. But only do when you feel confident, though. Oh, yeah. Alright. Oh, it's a honeycomb here, too. Yep. Uh, extra honeycomb and some feathers. Feathers which I don't need. Don't really need feathers at all. You don't get to fly much in Bubblegoo Swamp anyway. Well, you don't fly in Bubblegoo Swamp. Um, uh, you don't fly in Clinker's Cavern. Uh, technically you, you, technically you can't fly in Clinker's Cavern inside oh, of Clinker. Oh, right, the inside of Clinker, never mind, excuse me. David. Yeah. Oh, okay, so you can't fly in Mumbles Mountain or Bubble Swamp, that's about it. Yeah. Yeah, there's only two places you can't fly. So I, I was gonna say Rusty Bucket Bay, but there is a small, there's a place inside the building you can't fly. Yeah. Oh yeah, in that little shed where the honeycomb is at. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, that's Luria. Yup. Alright, it's time to deal with this asshole. Mr. Vile. I'm still vile with that. <laughs> oh, shit, I'm both <laughs> and yeah, yeah, he used to give me a hard time back when I was little. Oh, also, um, this is the only transformation out of all the ones that Mumble has that can actually attack. Yes. We're gonna play, we're not gonna chicken out you. Alright, first yeah, game. We won't, we won't be on every we'll be chicken out. Now, first game's easy, we just have to eat more red gum, please. Then, uh, Mr. Vile. Yes, the rain shoes are here. Um, uh, it make it a little easier with them. Um, but you have to come back, you have to batch, you have to come back here to later, unfortunately. So, I'm gonna just try to do it without the shoes. Yeah, it's only there if you're really, really having trouble with this, with this segment. I mean, if you don't beat it, then you can come back later once you get the running shoes. Oh, this gave me trouble, unfortunately. I'll say that now. I had a few attempts during round two and three. Oh uh, my god, don't give me slow in round goddamn three! <laughs> Right oh now. yeah, it, it's got this. It got this file too, pop a little bit. That that popcorn mission with Hunter. It kind of does, you know. Baby, anyway, we crushed this around round one. Oh, oh, never mind. We, we you want it for yep. now? Yeah, now we play the next game where you need to avoid yellow grumblies because they're probably not ripe. And oh, right, <laughs> ah, right out the. F oh, that's right. I cut that one out because I was failing. Lost oh yeah, one. if you if you tie, that still counts a loss. And here's what happens when you screw up. You lose health. Now, well, you could leave, but the problem is that if you leave, you gotta do round one again. Yeah, that's why I'm doing this. Um, thing. No, God damn it! <laughs> You got me fucking joking. <laughs> <laughs> That's how I felt during this skate. I, I, I shall not pass. <laughs> Sorry, Gantel. Fucking Boshi. Sorry, That Gantel. damn spider. I apologize, Gantel, but I must pass. You shall not pass. As I was saying, that even when you tie the game, it's still a count for loss. <laughs> Unfortunately, yeah, that's bullshit. I almost pressed that tap, but like, uh, no, don't. Not the red ones, not the yellow. Uh, no, this was actually my successful attempt. Don't do it again. I, I duped this twice, so this is false. So third time's a charm for me. I'm trying to find them quickly, because I keep seeing freaking yellows everywhere. I want some reds. You are getting sick and tired hearing that music. 
Oh, by two points. Now, yeah, here comes the bullshit part. Yeah, this one, you gotta watch what's on the screen. And I, after a couple of fails, I learned every 10 seconds it's gonna change. Alright, you always lose count. I didn't think about it while I was playing this. I'm, depending on which one's on the screen, you need to eat it. So the yellow ones come up, don't eat the reds. If the reds come up, don't eat the yellow. It's kind of weird once you really think about how it works, especially in reality. Yeah, <laughs> I I never thought about timing them out back then. Even when I let's play this better, I didn't think about that. I just kept an eye on the screen while I'm trying to eat these things and hope for the best. I really wish I knew about that sooner. Yeah, I think it, I think it mentions doing the uh, doing the all games done quick. I could be wrong though. Also, you mean also games done real quick? Oh, I said ultimate games done. I said games done quick. Yeah, there you go. Uh, mm -mm. Oh, oh my God! Oh my God! Yeah, I got nope. one yeah, just come fight me. Ow! It barely takes oh. more health out of you, too, asshole. Ah! 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 That's right. Put down the damn game, for fuck's sake. <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> it doesn't get... <laughs> Yeah, that was a cut because I do to I do to get during this, and I had to save save. Yeah, yeah, please save save, man, cause you gotta get all the damn notes again. Yeah, I thought I had to do the whole freaking uh, tip top in. Yeah, so. Like, well, I was wearing the jumps, like the tip top in. I'm like, no, I better not. So, yeah, I thought I was gonna start Stacy more on when I started Rusty Bucket Bay, but. No, it was on here, unfortunately. Freaking Mr. Oh, Mario. yeah, it's big as safe. Yeah, remember, that, remember that, that that little save that you had in Paper Mario? We had to do Chapter 3. Oh, uh, yeah. I, mean, I, I, t I tested it on Banjo Kazooie. Yep, that glitch is still there. Because I was playing Banjo Kazooie on my third file. I 100% claimed this cavern. I saved it quit. When I turned back on, it didn't save. Gosh. That's why, yep. That's why you say. That's why I want to say this for now on. Yeah, it helps. Whew. Now, um, Mr. Vile will challenge you again for three extra lives. You win the next three games. If, Not worth it. And for each one you lose, you lose an extra life. Yeah, like Celtic said, I'm gonna slide off like a slug. <laughs> Only in, uh, the secret around you to bath them them all. Hey, Mr. Val, kiss my scaly ass. <laughs> well, I mean, I'm a crocodile right now, so that's why I'm saying that. Kiss my scaly ass. <laughs> Bastard. Now, the unfortunate part is I got one health left, and I still got a few notes to go. Now look at that. Look at their sad faces, man. Yeah, they're not happy because of how low the health is. I mean, there's a dragon flower, that's why I gotta be careful. But, I got all ten, I got all ten jiggies. But I haven't got all the notes yet, though, so I have to be careful. Make out to a bad for the potential that, that stay in that freaking swamp water. Yeah. It comes with wrong white potential, because they don't, they ain't, they not fight me, <laughs> Oh, here's notes back there, too. Yep. Alright, come on, Drive Light. Hit me. Gotta take a death now. Come on. <laughs> oh, Grant's gonna laugh at you when you die. Or no, I should come. I was gonna try and attack him, but if I got hit, I'll... That's fine, because I'll have all the notes and jigs collected. Yeah. But I got lucky and got a hit on them, so... Yeah, with the crocodile, um, you can apparently get two uh, honeycombs off the dragonfly. It's at one, so that's actually nice. Alright, time to head out now. And we're gonna use our new transformation to go see Cheeto. Our next um character in the game. I gotta be on with you, man. Cheeto used to scare the hell out of me back then. <laughs> it's the freaking music that got me. Oh. I thought you were saying about how he looked on He's just a giant book. 
<laughs> and the way how you slap his uh, book. And it goes. Is that kind of cool, boy? Yeah. But well, this is this who again? That song's not so bad. Me. So bubble, bubble Gloop Swamp is all finished. Yeah, let's go see our good friend Shito. And as for the sheet and all, I'll probably do that in the next part. Yeah, that's probably some bad track. Yeah, you have, you have to unlock the sand castle again. I don't know why. Yeah, by putting a few blue eggs into the bucket. Or Patchy. I think it's Patchy. Um, I forgot his name. Yeah, Leaky. I can call him Mr. Patch also. That's not so bad, too. Uh, I was just because he eats all patched up with the eggs. Yeah. Yep, there he is. Oh, and fun fact, he becomes a bad guy in Donkey Kong 64. Uh, oh, yeah, yeah, I know, it's an evil bug song, that, yes. Yup, a creepy ca- uh, yeah, creepy castle. Yup. So, our first bet our cheat we're gonna get is blue eggs. Just put down the four treasure troll codes, uh, sand castle, you'll be good to go. Which, basically, as we get, uh, we get... Or, the amount of what we get will be doubled. I'll just kind of get back here. And, th and this bash decided to try to hit me. Jerk. Ooh, that was close. Yeah, luckily I don't get hit while I'm turning back to normal, so that's nice. Okay, so now we'll go do a little scoring over here. And th oh, there's the fish, by the way, I was talking about. If you're <laughs> in the water, he'll really gun for you and try to, uh, to attack you. Yeah, at least it doesn't swallow you whole like that one fish in Mario 64. Jeez. <laughs> Love doing that every time. You don't need Aren't this backpack, wearing a backpack? <laughs> It'll be too small for you, Gruntilda. Because it won't even care of her fat ass. Oh, uh, new grown up ahead. Just wearing blue now, but a little stronger. But can't handle that attack though, so. Bye bye. Yeah, I never used that uh that that punching mechanic. What the you know what that banjo does hit B only? He goes wah wah wah. Yeah, it's kind of a weak attack. Yeah. Yeah, I never used that. Falling boots are in here because that's the way you'll get across to go to Gobi's Valley because there's hot sand all around the uh the world. So but yeah, I know hurt. what you're doing. Oh, yeah, I know what you're about to do, cause, cause I, I've been doing that same strat now. Down the hole. And yeah, cause uh, we're going to three easy peak, right? But uh, I usually go to Gobi's Valley first to learn to move there, then start free easy peak. Correct. Yeah. Because there's a chicky there in free easy peak where you need the running shoes for that one. Yeah. You can't 100% that blood world. So technically, there's. That one's also a bit of a backtrack. Mm -hmm. Along with Bubble Goose Swamp, in case you want to use the running shoes for that one. Which is optional. But if you do happen to go to Freezy Peak the legit way, be sure to get all the notes first before you leave. <laughs> yep, that'd be the case. <laughs> yeah, I know some people like to do things the legit way, but, um. I kind of like to do things to the... Sometimes I, I'm like that too at, at times, but it kind of depends. Yeah, I understand. Also, matching cauldrons. So now we have our first shortcut. Oh, oh yeah, make sure to break this web too. <laughs> I'd rather do it that way, I'll just wonder. It's not, it's not gonna respawn. Yeah, because we're going to need that web broken for one of the Gratilda jiggies. Oh man, just imagine that's the 360. Oh, yes. That, <laughs> that note, that note would, would even age well because later it would have been released on the Xbox 360. <laughs> <laughs> right, Kobe's Valley is now open for business. Thankfully, we're not in summer yet because. We're about to start spring, well, on the day this report, we start spring in a few days. I know, I'm, I'm excited about that. Yeah. I, I, I can't, I can't deal with winter anymore. 
Oh no, the weather was so nice yesterday and today. So. I know, and today. And I'm and I'm glad they like saving time happened, because I hate when when it gets dark all early. I didn't sleep much, so that helped me well, but yes. It was actually nice to drive home on up. But there was still some sunlight out, so uh, complete darkness. So it was actually much better. Grab my volume boots real quick and we're uh make a quick trip into Colby's Valley to find bottles. That's all we're gonna do. Yeah. Just get the running shoes and then we're heading out. And Free Easy Peak has two more moves so you can get there oh. and that's gonna be it. Oh, and pay attention to Bottle's dialogue, though, when you enter, uh, Gooey's Bali. Oh, you missed... you missed Bratilda. I'll see her... I'll see her after I get the uh, shoes. Just pay attention to the dialogue. <laughs> one more move. Which basically... well, basically for this one will be the last one we're supposed to get. <laughs> and, uh, yes, I got that one no yeah. purpose. <laughs> Congrats, but you missed 99 notes. <laughs> I don't care. If they crash four. I don't. Alright, right, bottles, let's go. So, running shoes will help you go faster. And yeah, at a limited time. Just hit the walling boots, you have a time limit on how long you uh, wear those. Maybe those running shoes are a couple of shiggies here in this area, but we'll get to that later after we do Freezy Peak where we yeah. freeze our ass off there. Yeah, see, normally at, up to this point, Bob will say something about, Hooray, you found all the moves, well done. <laughs> oh yeah, that storm can be can be a troll, so uh, when you come back to um, Gobi's body, get that Dungeon first. Right, there we go, best of score for this world is now one. <laughs> <laughs> Which school is the awful Fatty Hattie? Fatty Hattie. Okay. Reads Warty Girls Weekly magazine. Warty Girls Weekly, okay. Class of her favorite cold. Ugh. Cold rum juice? Oh, cold. Hey, that, that's the Boogeyman's drink. <laughs> the Boogeyman. <laughs> yeah, er, old, all your resume should get that joke. <laughs> and anyone's had rumors of WWE, you're welcome. <laughs> Oh yes, down the mummies are here. Uh, these guys are going to be killed by using the gold feathers. Oh yes, I call fans and Jiggy too. Let's see if I can still switch in Kobe's Valley. Yeah. Uh, pass me. That was a wall a couple times. Can we not run to that again? Thank you, Governor. And I think that's going to do it there. I'm trying to do it. There <laughs> it is. Somewhat. <laughs> That'll do. All right. So next time. We're going to have some fun in Freezy Peak. Not mainly because it's freaking cold, but, um, um... Enjoy a little Christmas. Again. Christmas in March. Yeah, we are having this to... month, so yes. What about having the Christmas in July? <laughs> well, if we were doing that, I've been doing it four months later, then. <laughs> yeah. But, well, we're... Fuck Christmas in July. We're doing Christmas in March now. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yeah, that's what I was saying. <laughs> Alright, so, till then, later, folks. Later. Later.